What is going on, buddy? King Week on here today. I finally got my camera working, so that's a uh, yes. It finally works. Now I apologize for not getting this video out on time. Things happen, and but but here we are. You know what? Here we are. It's Go Tom Awesome Sauce Time, episode 306. Now, from what we saw from the TV Tokyo little report, next week is apparently the final episode of the Shogun Assassination Arc, so I'm not sure how they're going to do this episode, but I'm excited for it nonetheless. Oboro has arrived. Gintoki and Takatsuki just had one hell of a battle. What is going to ensue next? Let's go ahead and find out, man. So let's start right here. Let's start the recording. And three, two, one, let's jam. Oh crap. Alright, let me let me restart it. Now. No, it started off from there we go. One, two, three, four, five. Oh my god, it's showing the greatest from last episode. Ah, stop moving. There we go. Dude, I, I, I haven't gotten that Gendoke! Takatsuki yelled last, last episode of my head. So she does show you. Sakata Gintoki this. I apologize. Sakata Gintoki da. I haven't been expelled yet, have I? Bruh. Yo. Obro seriously came out of nowhere with that John. He just impaled him. I was like, damn, bro, is that how you feel? But Obro does look like a beast, I can't lie, man. When he when he lifts the eye like them. Damn, damn Oh well, snap, we're we're back to the um to the old one here. Yo, this 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 video is buffering a lot, man. Hold on, okay, let me let me restart this joke. Damn, 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 Ah oh, man. Oh, okay. We're back. We're back to the OG opening, which I don't mind. I don't. I don't, I don't mind the OG opening. It's just that the opening from last episode, I think, probably was my favorite in the entire series. Again, like, just seeing all the all the Taka and Gin moments again. Why is it buffering that? <laughs> yeah, no, that, that that last opening from last episode was phenomenal, though, man. I I have rewatched it so many times. It's just so godlike. Every single Takatsuki and Gintoki moment, it, it fit the episode so well. It's like man, it's it's amazing. Alright, look. It, it seems I might have to put down the quality because my my internet seems to be horrible today. So let's push this mug down, or at least let's wait and let's see if it buffers. <laughs> yeah, dude. The, the 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 Takatsuki and Gintoki version is opening was absolutely phenomenal. It, it's it, it it. I'm telling you, it's arguably my favorite opening in the entire series. Period. I, it's it's just it just shows all of that greatness, man. I'm like. Whoa. My, my heart can't take it, but this is the part that always gets me. Dun, 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 dun. Yes, I know, no, 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 Boku. No. Well, look at the shit that's going on. No, so good. Uzi Kagura, and I saw Kagura in the in, in in the little thumbnail for this episode. I was like, whoa, Kagura Jail is my wish and bashi. Yes, I know. Good time is now, bro. I'm telling you. Oh, is that? Oh, yes, dude. I'm telling you. This episode's about to be. This episode's about to be lit. The crow's call after the battle ends, ladies and gentlemen. The crow's call. The call. Episode 180 style. The meow, meow. Shogun assassination arc part seven. I apologize, man. This junk is buffering. Is it buffering to hell and back? So let me see. The crow's call after the battle ends. All right, I might have to put down the quality. Let me see. Let me let, let me let me see if 720 works. Cause my internet is being garbage. Garbage. All right, I let it sit for a while. Right here, watch Joke and Assassination in a bright room and a safe distance from your TV. And we're gonna start it here once again in three, two, one at two twenty six, two twenty seven, two twenty eight. 229, 230. And we see a human. We're seeing tree trunks being blown out the way. Who could it be? And Kagura is up against the wall, man. Kagura is up against the wall. It's going down. Oh, I love the soundtrack so much. 
And Conway just hits her with the big boot as one to her stuff. I love, I love when Conway's hair is like this. What's the matter? You can't stop me like this. Targeting your opponent's injuries without hesitation was good. But you were still about 100 steps short to, to mess around with me. Yeah! Ah! Dude, I, I don't know why. I just, I love Conway's long hair like that, man. Maybe for you, since you have short legs like Bobby. But like Mommy, I have a model's figure. Ooh! And she nails some Falcon punches! <laughs> this place just getting started more in front of mine. I, I love that, that still frame with Kagura, man. I loved it. And then Conway comes up and they're like Sanji, switching music. Da! Oof. Know thyself and know thy enemy is the basic tenet of battle. Why does Conway so savage? Take a good look at the length of thy legs. And then thy enemy. Oh, it, it, it just bah! The, the, I feel sorry for these trees. <laughs> they're stuck between a battle between you and Yato. My god. The enemy isn't always right in front of your eyes. There was Tendoshu members, ladies and gentlemen. The Tendoshu are here. Against Kagura and Cowboy. Who are these guys? Gonda! My boy! Look at my boy, dude. Yeah, it most definitely looks looks better than um than 303 art-wise. Uh, Kondo and Hichikata do that's for damn sure. Looks like this is it. Forgive me. Oh, she said Goofy! Oh, dude, next arc is gonna be so garlic! Oh! I love this. She's a gooey so much. I'm a tard. We made you die out of the shadows along with us. You have way Jigata. I don't care if my path there is paved by roses or thorns. Thornies? All that matters is that I die by my general side. Goat. Goat. All said. They try protecting my back to the last. Toshi. Yeti yeti. And I ask that you take your leave at the earliest. Rest assured, no matter who dies first, I'll use my puppeteering skill to control the corpse. That's a joke, it's not funny. Let's do this. I'll show them the, the last stand of the samurai and ninjas. Let's go! Woo! Snap! And an explosion hits! Three meteors fall to the sky. Auto! Oh my. That, that's. That's a huge shift, dog! Look at that! Look at the size of that monstrosity! Shogun Sama, everyone! Zenzu! And Saru Toby really, really got injured, yo. Real talk. My boy Shinpachi is leading, man! He's, he's, he's the new Shogun! He's leading up in here! Let me see him. Um... <sighs> Look at the Tendoshu, dude. They have an army. They're prepped and ready to fire, son. I mean, great job. Oh my! Your heroic acts are truly worth of praise. You did well to protect Lord Shige Shige from the rebels. Oh snap! Your truly royal retainers, dude. I love the red glow in this man's eyes, dude. Seriously, I mean, wow. Tendoshu. I see. I love the coloring, man. Especially the way the sunset is. They knew everything, but they played the silent observer and waited for this chance. Then when we, the Hitotsubashi faction and the Shogun faction, they would swoop in for the kill. Damn, these those corpse-eating crows. They are crows indeed. They think they could pluck our eyeballs out now. Bring it. I hope you didn't think you'd get off easy after butting into a Yato battle. Urgent message from the squadron on standby just off Earth. What is it? I love Abuto's voice actor, Red. It's the Harusame. Uh, uh, our squadron has been surrounded by a Harusame fleet. Ladies and gentlemen, the series, the, the tides are changing. It's, it, 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 the waves are shaking in the new world. Commander, 
They got the elders right in their pockets, man. It seems we were a bit too mischievous. There's the cruise! Shout out to episode 180. You all have fulfilled your roles. We shall ensure Lord Shige Shige's safety. Do not worry. You can leave the rest to us. Zenzu! All this time he did nothing but wait for the chance to crush the opposition. And now you want to take custody of the Shogun? After the hits of Tsubashi, you're looking to dispose of the Shogun because he stopped listening to you. Look at this bastard, man. He's green. He has white hair. He's ready. He's ready. I haven't the faintest idea what you're talking about. We're indebted to him. You should be grateful to him, too. Do you remember? You tried to leave your post as Shogun by submitting your resignation letter. Because there was nobody fit to succeed you back then, it was put on hold. Oh, man. Shout out to the courtesan arc. Now that a suitable candidate to take the reins of the country has been found. The Emperor has accepted your resignation. I give you the next Shogun. Lord Hitotsubashi Nobu Nobu. Henceforth Lord as Lord Tokugawa Nobu Nobu. That bastard. I mean, look at his face though, man. A Kamui leave the smack gun upon his candy ass. <laughs> Get wrecked. Hey, he, he, he hates him. Killed him. Hey, hey, hey. I had the Shogun. You're great. You, you know how badly Nobu Nobu hates the man. Yo, come <laughs> Yo, God, we sort of flying. That's what hit this stuff. Kill them all. And the Shogun, Tokugawa Nobu Nobu. Ah! Oh my. Here we are in front of the statue, and there's Obro. Obro's voice actress. That to you prepared was unexpectedly shrewd. In order to, to oppose the Tendoshu, you carried him so far and gave him so much power. But the moment we told him we'd make him the Shogun, he discarded you as an enemy without a second thought. How stupid. Look at Obro. You wanted to use your foolish king, but ended up being used by him instead. You defied the heavens and this is all you have to show for it? The Shogun you pinned your ambitions on, and the Shogun you pinned your hopes on, are both gone. All that's left is a puppet of the heavens. You took in the enemy's flag bearer? That bastard. Are you defying an order from your Shogun? Calm down, Lord Nobu Nobu. The crows will soon get rid of their remaining enemies. The crows, bro. Besides, nobody can stand in your way anymore. Not even the former Shogun. Now, hand over Lord Shige Shige. You should have realized by now that your horse spirits won't come to pass. I, this guy, seriously, I, I, it makes even less sense to hand him over now. Even if he has resigned from the post, it doesn't change the fact that the Shogun is the biggest obstacle in Nobu Nobu's way. And that's factual. Zenzo is speaking facts. What? Are you saying you refuse to hand him over? <laughs> you, don't, you don't need me to tell you this, but this is an order from Lord Nobu Nobu. An order from the new Shogun. Do you know what will happen if you don't obey it? Your loyal retainers who protected Lord Shige Shige's life. And we see Shinsengumi. We don't want to, you don't want to have to kill you here along with the enemy. Please don't force our hand. Shin buddy. Shige Shige moves forward because the thing Let's see what Sarutobi looks. Shogun sama. Look at this guy's red eyes, dude. Take Lord Shige Shige into custody. Stand down. You disrespect me. I said stand down. Are you aware of who I am? 
I am the Shogun. Tokugawa Shige Shige! Greatness. <laughs> That's three titles, though, that have been said. Lord Chiga Chiga, you are no longer. Did you not hear me? I'm saying I'm the Shogun. <laughs> and nobody can order the Shogun around. Leave my sight at once. Shogun, you. Forgive me, Senzo. Oh, man. You, you people put your lives on the line to protect me. Oh, my. Yeah, they, they were going in, man. They were pointing all of them. That is exactly why I must continue to be the Shogun. Oh, this soundtrack, bro. So as not to waste the lives that were lost for me in this country, I cannot run away from my battle. I am the Shogun, Tokugawa Shige Shige. The man who protects this country where my friends live. And to fulfill that goal, you'll even endure the deaths of your friends here? Very well, Shige Shige. I shall grant your wish. You gotta love Nobu Nobu, man. This is the fact of how great of a villain he is. The friends of a Shreel Shogun aren't as weak as you think. Shut it! Your friends have been rendered useless. Your swords won't reach the heavens anymore. No, they were broken a long time ago. I do the overall. Oh! And here they're deciding to show the freaking panels again, man. Why do you still grip that broken sword of yours? You killed your teacher and even battled your former friend. Look, look at all, look at how injured Gintoki is, bro. Just what is it <sighs> that you are trying to fight? Oh my God! Look at this. My enemy is right here. We've never changed. In order to become the kind of samurai we want to be. We've all been fighting our own selves. I love it. Yo, that boy. Sugita, man. Can't accept his brand of samurai or his methods. I'll stop him even if it means having to kill him. But I'm also the one who understands how he feels better than anyone else. And that's facts. In this world... We hated the same thing more than anything else in this world. You guys have no right to kill him. Be it killing him or protecting him. They're both my job. <laughs> that is my brand of samurai. Closes in on Gitoki's eyes. This is a good shot. <laughs> what do you have to say to that, Obro? To the people's champion. You really should have died back then. Oh my. Shoyu must be crying in the afterlife. The students he gave his life to save are burning with hatred because of him and throwing away their lives. Farewell, Shoyu's disciples. Go home to your teacher and your friends. And here comes Tendoshu. But Gitoki doesn't care! Look at that, he's gonna lay the smack gun upon all of them! What you mean? Let me see. Oh, here comes Oro. Don't take Shoyo's name in vain. Oh, you got Takatsugi. Yes, and he nails him. Takatsugi nails Oro in the same eye that Oro got him in. That's right. Kitoki and Takatsugi versus the Tendoshu. <laughs> Make sure you burn this into your memory too. Oh man, remember the last face you saw with that eye. Was it mine or his? Even if one of us dies here, the other will definitely send you to hell. <laughs> oh my gosh. Kitoki and Takatsuki versus Elwin. Survive? You're both fated to die here. Ooh, here goes Kagura and Kabui. Get wrecked. Too bad. Neither of them's gonna die. 
because they're both for me to kill. Shitsuke, I can't, I can't have you dying here. You promised to fight me as soon as I repeat my debt, remember? I won't let anybody kill Ginchan. That includes you. Come, I, lo I love how Congress air is, man. It's like half of it is up, the other half down. Then try to make it out of this alive. Prove that you are strong. Yo, we took it to him about there. He hit him in the eye, dude. Oh, that, that, that part always gets me. I'm not about to take orders from you. I shall return to my country with my own two feet. Along with my friends. It can't be. Sorry to keep you waiting. Show Matsu Naida, he's here! And he's ready to go in there like swimwear. <laughs> my boy! You crows. They're not dead yet. The Shogun of this country still has us. <laughs> as long as Shizugubi are around, this country won't go down easily. Sugu! Hey, so Sogo's hair is kind of blonde right here. What's going on? <laughs> Next episode, the Shogun assassination arc reaches its end. Out of the way! People have more freedom than they think. Oh, man. Struggle all you want. I'll go shall gladly be the last Shogun as a person before dawn. The night is darkest just before the dawn. But keep your eyes open. Tokugawa Shigishi makes his decision. Play close attention. Oh, man. So next week is the finale, as, as it's said in the thing. Oh, man, dude. That's going to be one hell of an episode, man. And I really hope that that, that, that isn't the end of the, of the, of the series. I, or at least of, of the anime. Because they need to animate the next arc after, man. They, you know, they, they need the app, too. It's going to be too much. Echo man. Ah, dude, I love love this. This this ending is is phenomenal, dude. It, it's godlike. But like this is my whole thing. Once again, hopefully next week we get some sort of insight towards how the arc is gonna end. You know? I'm really excited on finding out just how exactly this arc is going to end. Because or no, I'm sorry, not, not how they're actually end. Um, because I know how they're again. I read the manga, but uh, what 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 is going to happen after? You know, what is going to happen after? Because this, it, it, will this be the end of 2015 anime? And we have to get the next arc, man. The next arc, it just flows so well. It's... But we'll see. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Genpachi Sensei. <laughs> yeah, we're actually doing Genpachi Sensei here. Yo. Let's get right to reading fan mail. Let's get fuzzy something. It's a question from pen name Gorilla Gorilla Gorilla. Subjects change. Two episodes ago, it came to light that Gintoki became Shoyo's student before Takatsuki and Katsura. Bright in Gintama, the movie, Benny Zakura arc retelling. There's a scene where it looks like Takatsuki and Katsura are already in Shaka Sanjuku and Gintoki shows up like a transfer student. Was that an error? What happened to consistency? <laughs> They're trolls, you know. Please tell me. Yeah. When we made the Benny Benny Zakura arc retelling, we had no idea this was gonna happen. <laughs> we're so sorry. If you were expecting that kind of answer, we're sorry to disappoint. This stuff is per perfectly consistent too. Let's look back at the scene in question, and I'll explain. Oh my! Look at my boy Gin Dougie. Cut through a Ah, oh, and this soundtrack for it show you. Yes, it does look like Katsura and Takatsuki have already joined the school. When Shoyo brings Kintoki along, 
but as you can tell by watching it just now, this scene is, isn't voiced, is it? In anime and video production, it's fairly common for fully made scenes to get shortened due to time constraints. So we'll take the scene in question and add the voices it was meant to have. Let's watch it again to find out what really happened. <laughs> These guys are trolls. <laughs> Listen up, kids. He took a gun, lost his underwear. <laughs> <laughs> if anyone has proven to a look lost, please lend it to him. I'd rather not. You don't wanna. Is that so? <laughs> he took it. Use this to wipe your ass with more and get back to the class. <laughs> Chill! <laughs> There's actually a scene where Gitoki poops his pants and gets humiliated in public. With the added voices, I'm sure you're convinced now. I got a love goat rice, and that's all, folks. <laughs> oh man, I'm excited for next episode. Now, the next week marks the end of the Shogun assassination arc, man. My favorite arc of all time comes to an end, guys. It's 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 gonna it's gonna it's gonna, it's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be tra definitely a tale too. Wow, I'm excited. I, I can't wait. I cannot wait to see what's gonna happen. Because or I, I don't know what happens, but I can't wait to see if if we're gonna go right into the next arc. And I can't wait to see the finale of this arc animated, guys, because it's true. It truly is something special. But you you guys will see and. I, I just, I love when Gitoki and Takatsuki, they take off their arms, and he's like, no, the only one who can kill him is me. I love when Gitoki says that, man, but you guys have noticed today, and also with Takatsuki, and how he took out all of Oberos eyes, but well. I was like, who, who was the last person you saw, eh? Was it me? Was it him? It doesn't matter, because one of us will stay alive, and the other one that's going to take you to hell, say I to Sensei for me. You guys have noticed for today, getting top of greatness for Intellect Swimwear. It, it feels so good to be a Gintama fan because right now the hype is real. It is, you know, the hype is real.